Hi guys. So again, I'm here with Kat Rithik. Hi. Who is a gamer goddess. That's what I'm gonna call you. Ooh. Gamer I goddess. That. I am so curious because when we met, you were introduced as like an amazing gamer. And when I first heard that, I was like, okay, cool, gamer of what? Do you play a lot of like Nintendo 64? Because that was the last video game that I probably have played. And I didn't know what kind of game. Was it like computer games? Because I've seen it in movies before where like people are on the computer and it's an online sort of world or it like kind of like a Zelda thing from what I remember from N Nintendo 64. Or is it like a game on your phone? I had absolutely no idea. So then I begged Kat to come over <laughs> and kind of explain to me and show me what this whole other world is about because I'm really curious about it. I play a game called League of Legends and you basically, it's just this game where you play with your friends and it's five people on a team versus five people on a team. And essentially like an easy way to explain it is you're as a team over here on this like a square map trying to, t you have a half that's like your side uh -huh. and then the enemy has a half that's their side and you're trying to like take over their base okay and you do that by like a million different ways and strategies and you have to like work together to like get stronger and like figure out so it's like out. a mind game it's like it's a, kind of playing like chess you have to have a strategy and a plan absolutely to... okay when you play video games for a living you have to play 10 to 12 hours a day with your team or on your own if it's a solo game a lot of people think gamers guys right mm -hmm. but it's not really like that anymore you were saying no like i would say when i first started getting into gaming pretty heavily like five years ago the ratio was a solid like 90 to 95 percent male and like five to ten percent female i think now that's getting closer to like 80 percent and like 20 percent because mm -hmm. girls are starting to finally be like it's okay for girls to play video games right. like it's not nerdy or frowned upon and guys actually think it's cool when Girls have similar interests yeah. and play video games. So girls that are like, ew, I don't play video games. Like, I'm just girly. Like, I, I refuse to play. It's like, actually, like, it's, people think it's cool when you're a girl right. and you play games. So, I mean, yes, it's a little nerdy, but, like, who cares? It's 2015. It's kind of cool to be a nerd. And you also started a League of Legends, like, event, meetup, conference, what it was. Yeah, you... so because it was such, like, a fan base for the game, it's the number one played game in the world. It has, like... 80 million users or something that play, that play every month. Because of that, and because there's such a huge fan base and there's basically celebrities within like the field, you know, that the pro players. And so I wanted to like have a way where like the community of League of Legends could kind of like come together and just like love the game yeah, together. Yeah, yeah. So you can be like bronze, silver, gold, platinum, diamond, or challenger. And that means like how good you are. So if you're a challenger, that means you're the best in the world. Like you have a score within the game, the score ranks you when you play. And like that's how the professional players are found is based off of like. Wow, and so yeah. all of a sudden one day you'll be sitting on your computer and you get a phone call and the guy's like, <laughs> you are now a challenger. Like you have It's come. like that, that's but it's like within the game. It's a secret world. It is. Oh my gosh, so do you meet up with other girls <clears throat> And you're like, oh my god, you're a gamer, I'm a gamer. It used to be like really territorial, like girls in the gaming industry would be like, oh, I want to be the only girl in the gaming industry sort of thing. Oh, okay. But I feel like that's changed a lot and like I was never that way. Like I love girls, so yeah. I'm like whatever. When I go to these events, like the one I put on Summoner's Con or there's like tournaments where there's like Riot games or people that make League. Um, when Riot puts on like an event to watch a tournament, there'll be like girls there and it's kind of like the same girls that you see because okay. But like every year there's like more and more girls at these things, awesome. which is cool. And yeah, we do kind of like stick together. It's yeah. kind of like we're like the girls and girls are definitely finding like ways to like bond to because it's like there's so few of you. Right, exactly. So. so if you see me at the next gaming convention, you'll be like, hey Shay. I'll be like, hey, Hi. I'll introduce you to all my gamer girls. Awesome. So. Okay, can you show me a little clip? Now I'm in this game, it does kind of remind me of Zelda. Is that yeah, like, I, I mean, from like somebody who's never played games yeah, before? Yeah, someone who's never played games before, I could see why like that reminds you of that. Have you ever seen footage of like World of Warcraft maybe? Probably not. That, do you even, have you even heard of World of Warcraft? Wow, we are from different worlds. We world are such from different worlds, but that's why I always find it no, so it's, interesting. It's you know, cool. like whenever I meet somebody who is into something that I've absolutely never heard before, I'm like, this is amazing. I want to learn more. Like, I want to know, 
what it is, like what's the concept, what's, but I'm going to be honest, if I was playing this game, because I'm looking at it now, <laughs> I would be the person that like wanders off and is like, look at this <laughs> cool place. Like you I would be the would wanderer, be. you don't want me on your team for yeah. this League of Legends. Because yeah, people would be like typing in the chat and be like, hey, Shay, like, Shay get where back over are you here? going? And I'm going? like, guys, look, I found a cool waterfall over here. Like that is what I do when I play video games. I'm such a little explorer. explorer. I'm oh an explorer. Gosh, you would love like an RPG then, or like World I'd of Warcraft. I'd love an RPG. What or is an RPG? In RPGs, you pick like one character that you have, and you get to like explore a world. So it's not a competitive, as much of a no, competitive No, I don't want to compete. I just want to like yeah. wander. There's games where you can just wander and explore and discover new places. And cool. like, yeah, you'd probably really like that I probably game. would. This is looking really confusing to me. But, so do you have to bring your own laptop when you go to your friends' houses? Or if like... you if you want to play together at the, in one place, you have to have your own computer, like your own laptop. I actually ended up buying like my first desktop, like, PC computer so I could play better League of Legends. Oh my gosh. I need to know, like on a regular day-to-day, day -day, how long are you on your computer? Okay, I have significantly cut back on playing... What was the most you've, you've spent on your computer in one day playing League of Legends? 12 hours. 12 hours. I did the like about eight hours a day for like months. When I first moved to LA and I didn't have any friends and I just like played on my computer all the time. Oh my gosh. It was, That's dedication. Yeah. This must be a really addicting game. I don't even know uh, if I want to learn how to play it because <laughs> I have a lot of things I have to do in a day and like yeah. That's, it is a, it's a productivity killer. Well, I hope you guys learned something from this because I definitely did. Thank you so much for explaining it to me and me. to everybody else. I think that is awesome. You are a gamer goddess and Thank um you. Please send me over those RPGs so uh, I can <laughs> get my game on too. Awesome. Thank you guys so much. Um, message cat and message un like below here uh, if you guys have any questions. Because I asked her mine. I'm sure I'm going to have more, but I'm just going to like, yeah, okay. keep going with my questions. But ask her any questions. Um, comment below and subscribe, and we'll see you soon. Bye.